Want to use icons like me? Of course you do. Well then check out U7 Buy, the cheapest, most reliable place to buy foot coins. The place JD Gaming uses. Well, type in JD for a cheeky 6% off. Link in the description. Ladies and gentlemen, today we look at an icon that is special in my opinion. Very special. Now, Clarence Seedorf is a card that is underrated in my opinion. Not many people talk about this prime version. I think the baby or the base and the mid uh, are often used in the central mid department. And people are slightly confused about where you could use this prime version. I used him in a very weird position, left mid. <laughs> I know, I know you guys thinking, but he was incredible there. He was absolutely incredible. Now, don't get me wrong, it's not the only place I've used him. I have used him in other places as well. In central mid, he's good there. In CDM, he's pretty decent there. I mean, when it comes to his defending, he's not got the best defense awareness. But he's good at intercepting and he's also really good at beating you for pace. He's really good at tracking back and getting the ball back. But for me, there's so many better options in the central midfield department that I didn't want to use him there. So I used him in left mid where I didn't have anybody vacant at, this, at that specific time. And I tell you what, he was incredible there. He made some fantastic runs. He felt way faster than the 80-odd pace it says on him. He felt more like 87 pace. Maybe this Hunter definitely does work. And his shooting is just fantastic, isn't it? He's got really nice passing. The way he defends, he just runs back and gets the ball back. It's very kind of normal for him to defend. He's got that sort of small yet stocky body type. i tell you one thing I didn't like about him. I don't like his agility. Even though he's relatively quite diminutive, the way he turns is quite rubbish. Maybe that's because he's really muscular and he was really muscular. I mean, he, he still probably is muscular re even now. But he looks like he could win one of them, you know, natural bodybuilding competitions. That's how good his body is. Honestly, he probably would, wouldn't it? He's got some fantastic muscle mass on his body. He, he really is very muscular and very, very strong. So... I think he definitely gets a tick on there when it comes to physicality. Stamina is really good as well. This is a very nice card. And I think it doesn't matter where you use him. Left mid, right mid, cam, centre mid, CDM, strike. This guy's going to do a job for you. He really is. He's got incredible shot power. And do be aware of that because he will sky the ball a lot of the times. Because of just he's got so much power in his leg. He is relatively clinical as well actually he did get that ball on the back of the net quite a few times so this is a very nice card and i think it's one of them icons like nedved i'm trying to think like lothar mateus that can play in a different and can, can play in many different positions just depends where you've got a vacant position and this is a very nice card i, I really do think this card is a very nice card you know, because he's going to do a job for you literally everywhere. Now, when have you ever said that about a card? He's good in every single position he plays. Dare I say, this guy could even play centre-back if you want him to. He's just a very versatile icon. And he, he assisted a lot of the times. A lot of people scored goals because of his daring runs into the box. Or daring runs on the, on, on the wide side of the pitch. So, this is a very nice card. And I, I don't think... This card gets the respect it deserves. It, it surprised me as well. This icon surprised me as well on how good he was. He was leaving some of the right backs and left backs in. He was just leaving them. He, he was absolutely pacing them. So his pace is for real. It might be his pace. It might be his amazing attack positioning as well. Always just overall aggression to get to that ball. Really nice card. Very nice. More than happy to give him an 8.8 .8 out of 10. I do think this card is flawed. I don't like his agility. All right, even though his pace is very good, it, it would be nice if he was a bit quicker. And I do wish this card had a 5-star skill or 5-star weak for upgrade. This card, it would be incredible then. 